I'm just uh, editing this footage from our trip to Bend, and I wanted to say thank you so much for migrating over to my new channel, the Diana Beale channel, where I'll be throwing up the vlogs whenever I can. And I wanted to invite you to Seattle YouTube Day. It's going to be on November 3rd at the Living Computer Museum. Go to seattleyoutube.com to get more information. I'm going to be a panelist. See you there. Hi, this is Di, and we are at the High Desert Museum. We are just outside of Bend, Oregon, just south of Bend. And Jerry's parking the car, and we're going to go in. Doing, honey? Great. If you don't feel sick. And he's in a museum. He yeah. loves museums. I do love museums. He'll stay in a museum for days or weeks. He doesn't need food. Nothing. Mm -hmm. So I'm making him plan. This is a big one, so he's planned very strategically. Jessa, your stove goes outside the van, not inside the van. Outside. <laughs> seen so many in one place. Oh, there he is. There's one coming to beg off of me. Please don't eat my toes. Gosh. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Where'd he go? He's right under you. Oh. Are you kidding me? Hi. You think they're tame? And you think somebody fed them? Jerry's meal. Oh gosh, it licked my toe. I was afraid they'd think my toes were food. Well, they're not going to bite you. I totally have them. are tiny. They're not going to eat anything. They're so cute. you got to put the camera down. <laughs> but Jerry's food? My food. Jerry's drink? My drink. <laughs> They're swarming. They're swarming, I know. Don't feed them. There's gotta be 20 of them running around.
not sure how old I am, but um, Jerry likes new DMs where he's reading things. No. And I like all the live animals. Like, ah, birds of prey. <laughs> how did they control the burn to not burn the building down? Oh, they'll burn the, the undergrowth. The, the pine needles is what catches on fire. Mm -hmm. And so you just follow it and it burns in a, uh, with a leading edge. Chipmunks, that one's a ground squirrel. No, he's not touching my bare feet. No matter how cute he tries to be. an otters union. Somebody get me some non-union otters. Give him this proper space. Turkey, turkey. Yeah, he's named Horus. A very big wingspan. And they eat dead bodies like this. <laughs> Jerry, what did you buy your wife? Stuffed turkey vulture. Yes, he's leaving the museum. I had to have him. <laughs> it is a stuffed turkey vulture. When I was at NIH, oh look, he kind of, oh he cuddles. When I was at NIH, yeah, in the Festa, there were these magnificent birds of prey just flying and above the buildings between two of the hospital buildings and they were magnificent so when i got home i looked them up and found out they were turkey vultures i think they're called turkey vultures because their faces kind of look like turkeys because they don't eat turkeys unless the turkey's dead of course and rotting. they eat carry-on carry-on is dead rotting things that smell bad but they have a huge wingspan and they're magnificent they they flock in flocks of 500 that perch in the trees. Not creepy at all. If you see Sell one it. of these above your head, you're in big trouble. It's time for deodorant. Thank you. Oh, you're welcome. I like my turkey vulture. She took the tag off of him so that I could take her home and cuddle, cuddle. him. Because he yeah, needs so to cuddle. cuddle him immediately. I didn't want to wait and have him in a bag. Hey, how's it going? Good. Premium? Okay. Yeah, we're from Washington. We don't do it this right, way. Filling it up. Yeah. <laughs> okay, cash or card? Uh, cash. Cash. Okay. Turkey vulture is my co-pilot. <laughs> Cow. Look how much smoke there is today. It's time for us to go to dinner. We are walking to a fusion restaurant, but the smoke has changed directions and is in the neighborhood. <laughs> we are at dinner this cute global fusion restaurant and Jerry is here and no one is eating outside because of the smoke so we've got it, the dining to ourselves and oh Bigfoot already fish eggs on it doesn't it I don't know what that is it's like caviar of some kind I have to read the yummy menu. Here I got a salad blue cheese dressing I got these lettuce wraps 
and Bigfoot is still watching you. Look at how pretty that is. Did you get it? Yeah, now I get you eating it. And what do you think? This is good as mine. Maybe I not. Have a newer camera. Shouldn't have a full on shot of Bigfoot anyway. So we stopped over at the grocery store across the street. It's a really cool store. Not as cool as the grocery store in Mexico, but probably second best. It's really got a great selection. This I wasn't expecting to see. I did not expect that. I think they only have medicinal here, but that was medicinal. What do you think? Avocado pops? Look at that, it's got carrots in it. Any bets on if it's lower sugar? Four grams. Now let's see a regular fruit bar. 14 grams. So yes, the answer is it has a way less sugar in it. Ow. I have vision of wolf's heads on a t-shirt. We're back at the cottage. I am coloring. My turkey vulture is supervising. You know how something's so ugly that it's cute. It's just ugly. I don't know why. I like its little feet. I its little feet. I don't know why it brings me so much joy. <laughs> See, it just needs to be cuddled. Anyway, this is our cute little place. We've trashed it though. See our little kitchen? It's really little because like that's the table and chairs. So it's super duper tiny. But um, and we have a little bedroom here and there's a little, there's a little bed in the other room just for crashing on. I'll show you. So if one of us wants to take a nap and not be in the other one's way, we can do that. So um, I guess I'll say goodnight from here. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. I'll see you soon. God bless.